Okay, what we have here today is we're going to be working on the automoblox body. So I'll be taking you through the steps. Okay, so let's begin by sketching a rectangle, then filleting the corners before extruding. Well, I've already done quite a bit of this here. Notice they tell you it's 1.53 and it's 3.17. So I've already done that here on Inventor. I've made this 3.17 and 1.53. I've already extruded one, two, three, or I extruded, filleted three of the corners. I'm getting ready to fillet the last corner. And the way we do that is we go up here and we hit fillet, and we simply hit the two corners, the two sides that we want to make that fillet piece in. If this was not the right one, then I'd simply click on it and make it what I want it to be. So there we filleted it. Now I'm going to go to extrude. Okay, there we go. And I'm getting ready to extrude it. Um, this tells us it's 3.17 long, that's right here. So there, that's 3.17. The next thing it tells us then is select the top part, create a new sketch, and then draw and locate, with, locate a rectangle with filleted corners to represent the hole based on the appropriate measurement. So that, you want us to dig this, cut this out. Um, looks to me like it is 1.59 by 1.98. 1.59 by 1.98. So I'm going to go to sketch. Create a sketch here on top. And I've already forgot what we said. I think this is 1.98. I think this was 1.53. Hopefully I did those right. 1.59, Now the next part is I'm going to try to figure out you know, where I'm supposed to do it. That looks like that's a 0.6. And that's a 0.82. So from here to here, it's 0.82. And then from here all the way out to here, it's 0.6. So now we've got this centerpiece. Now I got a fillet again. Our fillets are 0.2. Uh, I just know from having looked at the edit. Um, I'm going to change it beforehand. Got to hit it up here again. Filet point two. I'm going to work my way around. Now that I'm done with that, I can extrude it. I believe it's 1.03, 1.07 down, 1.07 down. So let's go to model, gonna extrude. We're gonna make it go the other way. Now we've got our hole extruded there in the middle. The next thing I'm gonna do is an inventor, they show us there's this little cut. It's 0.3 from the bottom and it's 0.06 and it's got a depth of 0.06. So I'm gonna go here to I'm not going to do it on both sides. I'm just going to show you how to do it on one side. You'll do the same thing on the other side. Um, I'm going to make a tr rectangle here. Go from one side. I'm going to take it all the way to the other side. Snap it into place. I'm going to zoom in here a little bit. I'm going to say from there to there. It's point 0.3. And then from here to here. 0.06. The last thing I'm going to do real quickly here on this part, not all together, is I'm going to extrude it, except I want it to go the other way. And now you can see the little cutout we have there. Okay, the next thing I'm going to do here then is I'm going to put some text on it. And, oh, sorry. I'm going to put 
some text on it. And I'm simply going to say T9. Uh, so now we've got the T9 symbol on there as well. The next thing we're going to have to do now is we have the front and the back. I'm going to say that this right here is the front. So we're going to put a sketch on that front right there. And what I'm going to do here then is Here's the front. Uh, I'm going to assume that this is meant to be the back. Uh, but they tell us that this is one inch tall and it is 2.5 wide. So I'm going to go here, sketch, rectangle, and let's dimension it. It's one inch tall. 2.4 wide and if I recall this was 0.27 that's how far it is from the top now I gotta figure out how far it is from this side over here oh they tell us 0.34 Now I gotta do my fillets. Fillets, it tells me here there's four of them have a radius of 0.2. And I'm gonna extrude. I believe the extrusion here is 0 0.57. That's what it says right there. So let's go to 3D model, extrude, and we're going to, I can either hit cut, or I can tell it the other way, it doesn't matter which one you really hit. If you tell it to go one way and it's going into the piece, it'll automatically cut it. And then I'm going to do the exact same thing over here. You can see that I haven't made that cut over here. You guys would need to do that. I've got it over here already. So I'm going to go to 3D model. And here it's going to be 0.93 by 2.4. Still going to be 2.4, which means I believe it still was a seven Let's just double check that 0.39 from the edges and they tell us it's 0.3 from the top and bottom now I'm going to do my fillets Each of these on this side are also 0.2. Wood. Well, that's a good color. That's what I'm just going to stick with that for right now. That birch wood is a good color to say it is. And there's my T9 Automa Blocks body piece. Right. And I'll check real quick here. Do they have any other wood here? There's oak. Color is nope. Maple? Nope. Walnut? Nope. I'm going to stick with birch. All right. Hey, hope that was informational. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.